There are a couple things that you have to consider when you're when you're looking to live off campus. Consider what's important to you in terms of you know what you're looking for moving into a neighborhood. Every neighborhood is completely different. I was ready to kind of take the step away from the college campus. After I've, I finished my work at eight or nine or whenever it might be, then I could head back home and kind of separate myself a little bit. I wanted to have a place of my own that meant just a one bedroom apartment or a studio space. I knew that I wanted to be close to the school. I wanted to be close enough but also far enough out that I can have like a house because I have two children, so with a family. I found some prices that were pretty decent in terms of like, you know, something that I could afford as a graduate student. In Center City, it tends to be a little bit more expensive than, than west of the river. My friend, he actually lives in the city and he pays as much for his rent as I pay for a three bedroom, three bathroom house with yard. I mean, it depends on really what they want. If it's like transit or if they want to be close to school, it's definitely possible. If you were to live in University City where Penn is, that's right outside your door. Whereas it's kind of a trade off to live more in Center City or to the east of the river where you might be walking 25, 30 minutes. If that's okay with you, that was okay with me. If it's like rainy or snowy or something like that, uh, there's a shuttle bus that's nearby. There's a bus line. Regional rail. It's actually like five to 10 minutes away from the house, which is perfect. Try to get the lay of the land before you, you actually decide on a place to live. There's plenty of accessibility to, to resources, uh, to different restaurants, to places to go out, different activities in Philadelphia. There's the Wissahickon Creek, which is amazing. With the trails, I can take my dog or my kids, go riding their bikes or there's the stores. Do your best to communicate with friends and current students to find out exactly where the, they prefer to live. You know, it's harder whenever you're far away, you don't know how much money you're gonna get, how much you can spend on rent. Go through a, um, a website that you trust that you know have like a list of different um, leasing companies that you could rent from, um, such as off-campus housing.